In premenopausal women, one of the great worries is, is the treatment of my breast cancer going to put me into menopause? And patients are worried about that, particularly if they still want to have children. Let's talk about that. Well, breast cancer treatment affecting menopause can certainly depend on the stage of the cancer. If it's an in situ breast cancer and easily treatable, it, it may not affect menopause at all. On the other hand, if we need to use an anti-hormone pill, unfortunately that will tend to put somebody into menopause. Now, in our premenopausal patients who are having chemotherapy, most of the chemotherapy regimens tend to knock out the ovaries and a significant percent of those ovaries, unfortunately, don't come back. And so if we've got a patient in her 30s, late 30s, early 40s, we and still want to have children down the road, then one of the things that needs to be discussed is harvesting uh, eggs to be saved, cryopreserved, for a potential pregnancy down the road. In our postmenopausal patients who have already been through menopause, Many of the treatments, including if you still use tuoxifen, or more commonly if you use an aromatase inhibitor, which is a newer form of anti-hormonal therapy, they may have, in fact, more menopausal symptoms than they had originally, because now we're really starving the body of all estrogen. And so many women have said, well, gosh, Dr. Arnas, I was fine with the regular menopause, but what the heck has happened with these pills that I'm on now? So, unfortunately, with estrogen and progesterone receptor positive cancers, still part of our treatment is trying to starve cancer cells that may be elsewhere in the body of any estrogen. Also, the anti-hormone therapy has a prophylactic effect on the untreated breast to lower the risk of getting a cancer down the road. And if you've had a lumpectomy as an example, it will also help lower the chance of the cancer coming back in the treated breast. So it's an important part of our therapy. Menopause is a discussion you really need to have with your medical oncologist. And in, in, in this discussion, we want to also work on keeping you sexually healthy and keeping the, the lining of the vagina healthy enough so that sex is not going to be a problem. Have that discussion with your medical oncologist. breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.